then we're spending two days in Manhattan. A little staycation in New York City. Right now, we just checked in at the Hampton in Chelsea. Let me tell you guys about actually how I ended up booking this place really quickly. <laughs> so there is a website that actually allows you to book day passes at hotels so you know how like hotels you check in around 3 p.m and then you check out around 11 maybe 12 well there's a website called day use that's d-a-y-u-s-e dot com that allows you to stay at hotels basically any time of day so it's different time slots like it might be 10 a.m to 6. we have this particular hotel today from 2 to 10 p.m. And the reason why I decided to choose this option is because we spent the day already in Manhattan. We went to the Museum of Ice Cream, which was really fun. I'll insert some footage here about our experience there. We also went to, where we go, babe? Oh, the immersive game box, which I found on TikTok. Highly recommend. We did the Squid Game game. <laughs> that was super fun. And then now we're in the hotel and we'll be here until dinner. Rest, freshen up, and then head to dinner. And then we can come back because we have it till 10. So that's the idea. And it's much cheaper, significantly cheaper to do this especially if you just need a spot to kind of like chill. It also works if you're like checking out of a hotel, but your flight is in the evening, but you don't really want to spend another night in the town. You can also use day use. Not sponsored or anything, just wanted to plug that because I only heard about it through TikTok. I want to put you guys on. Wait, that's my husband's birthday. He's right here. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? We're celebrating him again today, Monday. It's October 23rd that I'm recording this. His birthday is tomorrow, officially October 24th. So go ahead and comment down below. Happy birthday, Michael. So wish him a happy birthday. But yeah, we're gonna chill a little bit and then I'll check back in with you guys when we are heading out for dinner. This is a quick OOTN of the night. So I have this dress from Zara. And then this trench coat is from Primark. These boots, I got them from Amazon, but they're from the brand Franco Santo. And I have this purse from Zara. And that's the, the full oh. And my watch is from Teleport Watches. So yeah, that is a full OOTN. It's not a game, it's a red skin. So we are back from dinner we went to brooklyn chop house in times square and before i booked there i was kind of like weary about the food because i saw a lot of mixed reviews like people saying that it was 10 out of 10 highly recommend really good and then people saying like they'll never ever go there again so i wasn't sure what to expect but we have some dietary restrictions so most times when people say recommendations for food we kind of take it with a grain of salt because we don't eat what they do anyway our food was really good to start we got the steamed edamame dumplings which i would say was it was okay who did you think babe yeah, the dumplings? I, think, I think it was i think it was good i think it was good. so michael liked it i thought it was just okay you had that to start and then vegetable spring rolls the spring rolls were good however it comes with two only two they were Pretty big, but still two for $17, which to me, a little pricey. And then for our entrees, Michael got the salmon and it came with vegetables in a nice tangy sauce, which he absolutely loves. He loved it. It was really excellent. good. Yes, yeah. you hear him? It was excellent. And I tasted it for myself. It was very tasty. It was really good. One very of the best 
salmons that I've had in a while, and that's saying a lot. Yes, and he gets salmon almost every time we go out. Like, it's salmon or vegetarian because he's pescatarian. I had the sweet black bean Bayesian chicken. It was good. I do recommend that. And then we had for sides the veggie fried rice, and which was good. And the garlic ginger mashed potatoes, which was also good. So highly recommend that place, Brooklyn Chop House. Uh, oh, and for dessert, we got the fresh strawberry cheesecake which was really good we'd go there again they also have a downtown location also if you guys don't want to be in times square and brooklyn trap house is black owned so huge um shout out to the owners there for that one but anyway we're about to check out of our hotel again i had this reservation for the day only it's from 2 to 10 it's 9 48 <laughs> 948 literally as we speak so we're about to head out and head home and then we'll be back in Manhattan tomorrow for another full day of activities celebrations for my lover and my best friend yes. my husband <laughs> Michael <laughs> his actual birthday is tomorrow it's but tomorrow, it's yeah. already evening so it's your birthday babes my birthday yes okay. it's gonna be fun tomorrow looking forward to it yeah so I'll see you guys tomorrow Day two in Manhattan, about to be our first adventure. So it's day two of Michael's birthday surprise. We are doing an escape room. The place that we're at is called Mission Escape Games. And I chose here because they allow private booking. So it's just me and him playing versus us being with um, strangers, basically. We are escaped! escaped. <laughs>